pages from pages, 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 pages. That's really hard to say. Marisha Patel, is it Patel? Pestle. Marisha Patel, I said Patel again, it's Pestle. <sighs> Hey guys, it's Jay, and today I'm here with my Spookathon TBR. Honestly, I'm probably not going to get any of the books I say I'm going to read done because it's literally right in the middle of my midterms. The theme is thriller, and that's what I love, so this readathon is right up my alley, so I definitely want to at least try to participate. We'll see how it actually goes. It's run from October 17th to October 23rd. It's run by Lala from Books and Lala, Page from Pages Pages, and Shannon from Bookerly. So I'll leave all their links down below if you want to check them out. And so without further ado, let us get started. There's a total of five challenges that you're supposed to try to complete. Realistically, I will complete none of them, but we're going to try anyways. First challenge is to read a thriller. So I am going to try to read Night Film by Marisha Passell. Said it right that time. Nailed it. I don't know that much about this book, but everybody says that it's amazing and it's like one of their favorite books so I figured I would give it a try. I know that there's a young girl who gets found in an abandoned house and they say that it's a suicide but the investigator says it's not a suicide so he starts investigating and then there's like a director and he tried to catch the director before or something like that but shit went down so now this is his like second chance. I really like that it has like web articles and stuff in it like it's it's cool. Look at that. I just, I'm excited. But realistically, it's not going to happen. But we can pretend. The next challenge is to read a book with red on the cover. I'm going to try to read Tales of a Haunted House by Frank Carcota. And this was on my October TBR anyways, so as you see, there is red on the cover. But it's about a haunted house that has its secrets, and when people move in, if they discover the secret, bad things happen to them. So it's very short, so I might actually finish a challenge. We'll see how that goes. Next challenge is to read a book with a spooky word in the cover. So I am going with Beware of That Girl by Teresa Toten. And I don't actually 100% know what this book is about, but I'm pretty sure it involves like a stalker or something like that. So, you know, thrillery. Feel like it goes with the theme. We're going with it. And Beware is a creepy word, okay? So we're going with it. The next challenge is to read a 2016 release, so I am going to read The Hatching by Ezekiel Boone, and all I know about this is that it has giant spiders, and it's supposed to release July 2016, so it's already out. But giant spiders, man. I'm not okay with this. I don't want to be in a world with giant ass spiders, but I'm going to read it because it's thrillery. And also it's released in 2016, so that's a challenge, so we'll see if it happens. The final challenge is to read a book with a paranormal creature or character, and I don't know if this really counts, but I'm going with it. It's going to be Clockwork Princess by Cassandra Clare. This is the third book in the Infernal Devices trilogy. It's at school right now, so that's why I have the jacket. I'm almost done it, so we're counting it as I'm reading it for the readathon. Shh, it's fine. It has, like, angels and demons and stuff like that, so I think think it counts, we're going with it counts, but I'm excited to finish this book because I've been like systematically working through it this October and I'm obsessed with it and I just need to know how it finishes. Alright guys, so that is my Spookathon TBR. Don't know how well this readathon is going to go for me, but you know, girl can have hopes and dreams. I will see you all in my next video. Goodbye! Yeah.